At times, our mind might trick us, leading us to perceive things differently from their actual state. When observing a certain item results in seeing something entirely different, we refer to this phenomenon as an optical illusion. Magicians excel at utilizing these illusions to execute mystifying tricks. Moreover, optical illusions have recently gained popularity among interior decorators. Many individuals craft remarkable environments through the art of illusion, leaving a lasting impression on others. In our current video, we present unique approaches that could leave you feeling lightheaded. The creativity of workers in certain firms plays a significant role in generating substantial revenue for their owners. Experiencing your product firsthand is the most effective method of promotion. Duncan Cook, the proprietor of Casa Ceramica, a British ceramics firm based in Manchester, accomplished precisely this. He installed an optical illusion resembling a pit on the corridor floor of the company, crafted from regular tiles. The primary purpose of this illusion is to decelerate the pace of both employees and visitors who tend to hurry through the corridor too quickly, and more importantly, to captivate their interest towards the floor. Contrary to what one might expect, the tiles are not laid out in a straight manner. Interestingly, they can be set up in a unique manner. Duncan Cook, the proprietor of Casa Ceramica, recorded videos showing himself initially strolling around the perimeter of the deceptive pit and subsequently walking straight over it. This elucidates how the pit truly manifests solely within the observer's perception. I ponder whether individuals feel vertigo while navigating this passageway. Please share your thoughts about it in the comments section. Incidentally, the optical deception is visible from a singular perspective only. From alternate viewpoints, the illusory impact vanishes. Picture returning home from your job to discover an individual clinging to the building's exterior, gripping the windowsill for dear life. Naturally, your first instinct is to hurry to their aid and alert emergency services. However, there's no need for haste on this occasion. You're being introduced to another piece. Leonardo Ehrlich, an artist from Argentina, is celebrated among modern art aficionados for his daring and innovative manipulations of space and shape. The creator produces visual deceptions that are beyond imagination. Republican constructed a compact living structure in the traditional Victorian design. However, the issue is that the front of this structure isn't upright, but instead, it rests horizontally on the surface. Above that, a gigantic mirror, as large as the building itself, is positioned at the perfect angle. Because of this, all activities taking place on the ground-level facade are mirrored above, allowing individuals to walk, recline, and children to frolic, while adolescents enjoy themselves, all seemingly part of a whimsical world overhead. Encountering optical illusions while dancing on a bent surface, like imaginative designs on the dance floor, or unique color schemes in a regular household setting, becomes a frequent experience. The European carpet brand has opted to alter its norms and develop a floor covering that features an optical illusion. This illusion, much like that of Casa ceramic tiles, will mimic a floor that appears uneven. This producer is favored by numerous clients, including hospitality venues like hotels and expansive hotel complexes, as well as showrooms and art galleries. What draws customers in are the distinctive designs and visually striking effects. Specifically for a particular dance endeavor, the firm crafted a rug featuring a unique distorted mesh design that mimics the intricate root system of a forest. To enhance the performance, the dancers wore black costumes. It's hard for us to imagine, but that carpet looked unbelievably real. Do you suppose the spectators were at ease observing the dance? In the 21st century museum located in Kanazawa, Japan, there exists a fascinating swimming pool that creates an optical illusion. It appears to be brimming with water, yet individuals stroll peacefully at its base, fully clothed, and show no inclination to surface for air. The swimming pool was created by the same artist from Argentina, Leonardo Ehrlich, who appears to have overcome the principles of physics. Actually, the pool has a clear cover topped with a thin layer of water. The illusion is enhanced by basic metal ladders descending into the pool. The walls inside are colored blue, making it look to observers from above as though individuals are actually submerged in water, rather than in a confined space. Fascinatingly, the exhibit has been around for 2,004 years, yet the concept behind it continues to feel utterly fresh. This feature was a hit with everyone, notably with individuals who have a fear of deep waters. It offers them an opportunity to attempt conquering their phobia. The proprietors of a bookstore situated in Yangzhou 
a city within Jiangsu province in China, devised a novel strategy to draw in a maximum number of customers. Upon entering, customers get the sensation of stepping into an alternate universe. The designers employed numerous mirrors to transform the shop into a limitless labyrinth of books. The design of the interior was crafted by XL Muse Architects, based in Shanghai, drawing inspiration from the renowned Yangzhou Canals, which are crossed by arching stone bridges that have been celebrated by well-known Chinese poets. Upon entering the bookstore, visitors are immediately transported onto what resembles a river of books. The floor, made of black glass, conjures an illusion of guests hovering over the books. Upon exiting the tunnel, customers enter a reading space designed as a square-shaped office. In this area, not only can they pick out a new read, but they also have the opportunity to unwind amidst the knowledge gathered through the ages, all while enjoying a cup of tea. The meticulously chosen hues and geometric patterns of the decor serve as an excellent marketing strategy for any shop. Should you be someone who enjoys exploring unique and intriguing destinations, then this extraordinary spot situated in Seoul, the capital of the Republic of South Korea, warrants your attention. It's aptly described as an artistic masterpiece that seamlessly merges the realms of actuality and animation. The quaint Yeonamdong 23920 Cafe is designed to appear as if it's a two-dimensional drawing. Guests can indulge in an assortment of desserts, coffee, and various beverages. Given its captivating design and clever use of optical illusions, it's no wonder the first cafe quickly became a major draw in Seoul, especially for tourists and bloggers fascinated by decor. Founder Yoon Jin Lee explains that the black and white cartoon-like look eliminates distracting colors and noises, helping guests escape the city's chaos. The primary objective of the designers was to employ the most basic and unadorned components of space available, with an emphasis on the more important aspects, individuals, favored beverages, and sumptuous desserts. This embodies the core principles of the minimalist philosophy. Many buildings captivate with their looks and draw the gaze of those walking by. However, there are also structures that designers intentionally keep out of view from the public. In the forest, the House of Mirrors vanishes entirely. The firm from Sweden, Tam and Vidigard Hansen Architecture, has designed a unique structure, a treehouse shaped like a mirror cube. This remarkable creation is situated in the heart of the forest, close to Hareds in Sweden, just before the Arctic Circle. An aluminum frame, light in weight and measuring 444 meters, was installed encircling a pine tree. Its exterior is clad in mirrored panels, which camouflage it within its environment by reflecting the sky and surrounding trees. The inside is lined with panels of plywood. The windows provide sweeping views of the environment around. It can accommodate two inhabitants. It features a double bed, a compact bathroom, a tiny kitchen, and a balcony. A bridge leads to the mirror house. The exterior is coated with a fluorescent paint, visible only to birds to prevent them from colliding with the house's walls. With that, we wrap up today. Share your observations in the comments. Until next time, 